I have a sudden burst of energy today, so I have decided that I am going to recreate cozy Pinterest outfits that I've saved for my board with clothes that I already have in my wardrobe. I've been lacking outfit inspiration, as you can tell. I'm literally just wearing track shorts and a t-shirt. I've got nothing, okay? It's zero over here. So I have been scrolling Pinterest recently, and I have saved a bunch of outfits that I think are absolutely gorgeous. A lot of Pinterest outfits are pretty much just basics with a hint of pattern or a hint of something going on. So I wanted to recreate them today to not only spark some inspiration to myself, but also to you guys who may be lacking inspiration as well. These outfits that I'm recreating today are going to be a little bit more cozier than usual because it is now autumn here in Australia. Despite our weather and the fact that I'm sweating right now, it is autumn. But I hope that you guys transitioning into spring and summer can also gain some inspiration from these outfits as well. And also I'm highly jealous that the fact that you guys are going into summer like i hate winter do you want to swap do you want to do all swapsies if you are new to my channel hi my name is shelly i make random videos every sunday and i might even start uploading twice a week so you don't want to miss out for that so do subscribe and turn the little bell notification on so you don't miss out on me also feel free to follow the gram and tiktok as well because i post a lot of random stuff on there so you don't want to miss that either but without further ado i'm gonna shut up well not really i'm gonna continue talking throughout this video and let's get into recreating interest outfits love this outfit because it's a very casual yet put together style with clothes that we all have in our wardrobe 100%. When I first saw this I was like damn that looks so good and then I looked close and I was like wait I literally own every single one of those things just in different colors. I don't have brown flares but I do have black flares that I got from Kmart so those will do the trick. Then I also have this white little crop that I got from Cotton On. She's a little bit dirty. She's got a little bit of fake tan on it. It's pretty much the exact same tank. I think hers has more of a lower cut but it doesn't matter it's the exact same I have this black cap from Orphanx, which i think will do the trick since i don't have a brown cap <laughs> these are my whitest cleanest sneakers that i have so i thought that i would use these otherwise y'all would be judging me i got some dirty sneakers considering her bag is brown to match her pants and her hat i have this little black handbag that i got from princess polly or cotton on it was one of them i totally forgot about the most important aspect about this outfit and it is the long sleeve like how did i just completely miss that my eyes could not see that i just got this long sleeve from my boy from my boy why can i not say that my boyfriend's wardrobe yeah this is the whole fit i don't know how i feel about it i feel like a flare really elevates a whole outfit like if i was just wearing regular leggings this would kind of suck like it wouldn't have the same effect but you know, I'm looking in the mirror. She kind of a vibe. Like, not gonna lie, she kind of a bop. I like it. I'm on the fence about the long sleeve. Like, I don't know how to really feel about it. Maybe on those more cooler days. But I feel like just for Erin Run, I like this a lot better. Like, I don't like the shirt. Get away from me. I don't want to see you. Like, it's very rare that you would see me in a shirt. And if you do, maybe ask yourself, am I okay? Like, what's going on? I give it like a five out of ten. Like, I'm not loving it, but I don't hate it. The next outfit I wanted to recreate was... This denim jacket high boot outfit. I'm so excited to see the return of the denim jacket because I've had my denim jacket for the longest time, hoping that they would come back in. Not that it matters, like I would wear it anyway. Just nobody was wearing a denim jacket and I'm like, what's going on? What has happened? It's originally from Cotton On. I remember I got this on sale for like $10 and it was the best thing ever. I don't really know what she's wearing underneath, but I do have this big white tee. This is Tyler's. So I'm gonna wear this underneath, hoping that it kind of gives me like a t-shirt dress effect. I've got these high boots that I got from Princess Polly. I think these are perfect. I just realized there's a spaghetti stain on the t-shirt so representing that. And then she's kind of got the denim jacket buttoned up which I don't think in my whole life I've ever buttoned up this denim jacket. So this will be interesting. I'm also sweating right now trying to do these buttons up like it's hot. The leather boots, the denim jacket, she's getting hot in here. I really only own one black bag so we are accessorizing with this black bag again. I have these black sunglasses that I got from Cotton On. And then she has these hoops in but I don't own hoops. I've just got my little danglies in but I thought this outfit would look elevated with these big boys in. I got these from Kmart. They were like $3. Absolute bargain. Honestly, I kind of like this. I could wear this out to like a concert or some kind of night event. I feel like this would be really cute. She's a lot less oversized than it used to be because I had this when I was like 15. That was 10 years ago. So, you know, do the math. I just undid it to take the outfit off. I saw myself in the mirror and I was like, wait a minute i love this so much more this is so much better on with outfit number three which i think is so freaking cute and i have all of these pieces except for the shoes i feel like if you spoke to me maybe like 10 years ago when i was still in school i would have had so many pairs of those but i don't i'm going to wear my connies which are disgustingly yellow 
you're done. I have this little black skirt from Kmart. This was from Kmart. This is from Kmart as well. I got this from Jeans West and despite the tags still being on this, I actually really like this shirt. I just haven't had a chance to wear it. Now I have a white headband, but I cannot find it for the life of me. I've literally turned my house upside down to try and find it for this video, but I can't. I actually own two of them and I can't find a single one of them, but I did find this little black headband that I do have. I don't really know what this is going to look like, but fingers crossed, still cute. And then of course, the black bag once again. I really love the look of headbands, but for some reason when I look at myself with the headband on I just can't help but feel that it looks so silly like I don't know how I'm feeling about this one like she's cute but I don't know if it's me so I'm gonna give it like a four out of ten what if I take the headband off is it the headband and what if I put my glasses on okay it was the headband all along we are putting full blame onto the headband you are guilty big on this is instantly moved up to about an 8.5 out of 10 like i like this a lot and this next outfit i am absolutely going to be sweating my tits off in because this is very layered very beautiful though which is why i wanted to recreate it so normally i would wear a long sleeve with this outfit because my long sleeves have more of a higher top but I will actually die. I'm just gonna wear this t-shirt, so just imagine that this is a long sleeve. I'll wear the Kmart flares again because I love these pants. And then I got this jumper from Ganda. I'm just gonna put on the Pumas again because these are my cleanest sneakers and I've learned from the Connies that I never wanna do that again. This jumper is really oversized as well, so I'm just tucking it into my flares. So it kind of gives it that oversized scrunched up look, which I adore. I absolutely love oversized sweaters. I think they look amazing. She's got like more daintier hoops, but she's also got the rest of her earlobe pierced, which I don't. One day, hopefully. So I'm just going to keep the big hoops in to give the illusion that there's a lot of jewelry there, but it's just one big hoop. It kind of has this like put together bun style, but high up. I don't know how to explain that, but we're going to try and do that. Kind of, well, no, that's not it at all. <laughs> we're gonna go with it. We're gonna go with it, it's fine. I have this chain. I've had it for so long, I don't even remember where I got it from, but it probably would have been LaVisa. I used to get a lot of my jewelry from LaVisa, so I'm gonna pop this chain on. So I've got this little one. I'm pretty sure I got this from Kmart. Probably either from LaVisa or Kmart or Cotton On, because that's where I always used to get my jewelry from. Oh my God, we are layered up. How are we looking? How are we doing? <laughs> I think that's honestly very close to what she's wearing. She just obviously has a high neck top on, but I would sweat to death if I put on any long sleeve. I don't mind this. I really like this. It's very Pinterest or very like city vibe. Like I feel like I would see a lot of people in the city wearing this. And like, I'm not mad at the hair. She's okay. She looks better this side for some reason. I don't know why. I'm probably gonna give this like an eight out of 10 because I really like this. I love the layers. Okay, the next outfit is from one of my favorite girlies, Olivia Messer. She always has the best fit. For this outfit, I have these white cowboy boots from Princess Polly. I'm going to use this beige bag. It'll also go with my boots. Once again, back into Tyler's wardrobe. I got this heavyweight t-shirt that is from Cotton On. I don't have a denim skirt, but I do have a cargo skirt. This is actually so cute. Like, I wouldn't even think to put a baggy t-shirt with a cargo skirt, but it looks so good. I am obsessed. I don't know how she's tucked the shirt in there. Like, that's the only thing that's got me so confused. But I have this little flower claw clip that I think would go with the outfit aesthetic. I feel like my hair is too thick for these kind of claw clips though. Like, I feel like they never stay. Is that staying? I'm not sure. I can't see what it looks like, but I'm sure it's adorable. Freaking love this. This is definitely like a nine out of 10. You know, maybe even a 10 out of 10. I don't know. What do you guys think? I'd love to know. This outfit really caught my eye because it's definitely something that I would wear. I have this little tank from Supre, so I feel like that will be perfect. And then I have these cargos from Cotton On. I wore these all last year in winter pretty much. Like these are my favorite. And then we're going to do the Pumas again. And then we're going to do a black glasses white bag from Princess Polly. And then she has a little flower claw clip on her bag. So I will just be using this one again. Now she has a black leather coat. I do not have a black leather coat, but I do, however, have this black teddy coat. So I'm gonna absolutely swelter in this. Now she does have her hair up in that like slick back ponytail vibe, which I'm not the biggest fan of, but I will do it for the video so we can get the full effect. And then she's just got black glasses on, which I like a lot more because I'm less exposed. Like I feel like the coat is putting me off. I feel like if it was a leather coat, it would work a lot better. But I am a fan of of the outfit without the coat. I love this so much more, are you kidding me? I can vibe with this, you know, I don't mind it. She is cute. The outfit alone, I would say a seven out of 10, but with the coat, it is instantly a three out of 10. Like, 
no deal. I feel like this would be such a fun little city fit. Like this would be an outfit I would wear to the city, going to grab a coffee, taking some cute pickies. I'm gonna wear this little black skirt. I actually got this from Cotton On Body and it's actually a skort. I feel like skorts should be a bigger deal than they are because skorts are amazing. Once again, Tyler's button up from Target. This makes me feel like I'm back in high school and I'm getting ready for school because all I used to wear to school was the white button ups and the skirt. This is kind of taking me back. Put the yeehaws on. Now I do have this little leather jacket which I probably could have used in my last outfit but we're not going to talk about it hush hush I actually thrifted this leather jacket and I was originally going to donate it again because I never wore it but I'm having second guesses so if you saw my closet clean out video no you didn't I'm going to use this little bag that I got from Supre I think this is super cute and then I'm going to wear this hat that I got from Kmart. It's definitely giving Pinterest. Like I could definitely take a photo in this outfit. Like people would be like, she is a Pinterest girly. I don't know if I would wear this out anywhere other than like an Arctic Monkeys concert. So I'm gonna give this like a six out of 10. Like it looks so good on the Pinterest girlies. Love that for them. But when I put it on, it's like, there's something in me that just wants to recreate this outfit and I'm so excited to do so. Like knee high boots, the skirt, the knit, like I'm obsessed with this. I love this so much and I feel like I would definitely wear something like this in the cooler days. So I have this white skirt from Cotton On Body. It is also a skort. Once again, I love skorts. I don't have a cropped chunky knit sweater like her, but I have this massive chunky knit sweater that I got from Glassons like five years ago. Okay, so I've tucked this up into my bra. I feel like it's doing pretty well. Like it looks kind of silly, but not too silly. But I'm just going to pop on the boots because this is like the main part of the whole outfit. It's the boots that count. I love this. I almost just want to crop this sweater permanently because every time I wear this sweater, I'm always cropping it. I am just going to pair this with this little white bag here. We have ourselves an outfit. You know what? I love this. I can definitely see myself wearing this on the cooler days of autumn. It's so hot underneath this sweater. Like, Holy moly. I'm so happy that I came across that Pinterest outfit because I probably would never think to put this together. Like I always wear this sweater, but I always wear it as like a full length kind of thing. And I'll put like shorts or something underneath, but I've never thought to just tuck it up and wear a skirt with it. Like why have I never thought of that? I don't know. Now this outfit is going to low key suck because it requires layers in this hot sweaty weather. So I'm gonna die. So we're gonna start off by putting on this white long sleeve that I got from Supre as well as some black ribbed leggings. This is looking pretty familiar because this is all I used to wear. Yeah, I used to wear. I said it like it was forever ago. Literally last year in winter and autumn and spring, whenever it was cold, this is exactly what I would wear. So now we're gonna add the black cap that is still cute I don't mind it so I put on my socks make sure they're like super high I thought these cream boots would do the job I think these are super cute and they're kind of like the gray ones except mine have shoelaces which I actually kind of don't like I don't prefer hers I got these from cotton on three years ago I've had these forever and I've probably worn them maybe a handful of times I want to try and wear them a lot more because they are super cute boots they're a little bit tight I just realized how linty my leggings are can you see that lint I have this white quarter zip and I'm just gonna grab the sleeves and tuck it over me just like that hello suddenly she's a fashionista what do you mean this is cute I would wear this on like a walk this is giving like morning walk aside from the shoes I've just realized I'm wearing boots it's not morning walk vibes what am I saying I could definitely see myself wearing this on the very cold autumn days like it's about to be winter I'm gonna give this a 7 out of 10 she cute I don't mind it this outfit I feel is very city-esque once again they always say to act like a future self and I feel like future Shelly lives in the city so I'm gonna be dressing like future Shelly and then hopefully you know fake it till you make it one day we will be in the city the basics of this is pretty much something that I would wear which I'm super excited I have this black boob no I don't I threw it away boob tube that a friend handed down to me actually so thank you Michelle if you're watching this love you and then pairing with that boob tube I will be wearing these black tailored pants that I got from Princess Polly I wear these a lot and I mean a lot. So this outfit already feels very familiar to me. I think this is the start to a really cute night out, you know, going for a boogie, going for a dance. I think I am gonna wear this on my next dancing occasion. This girl is wearing a belt, so I am just gonna pop this belt on. I'm pretty sure I got this from... I might have got this from like TK Maxx or something. I can't remember for the life of me. It's been so long that I've almost forgotten how to put a belt on. I'll tell you what, I've never been a girl to just wear a plain outfit like this and a belt. Like I've seen so many of my friends do it. I've seen like so many celebrities and things do it. But I've never done it myself and like why? 
That's the only thing that I have to say to myself is why? She has a throwover sweater, so I'm just going to use this quarter zip again. I don't have a stripy anything in my wardrobe. I used to be obsessed with stripes when I was like 14 for some reason. And then I just grew out of it and I never want to see a single striped item in my wardrobe ever again. I mean, maybe, maybe one day, but for now, I don't have anything striped. So this will have to do. It's a quarter zip. It's my favorite. It's from Savelle, the label. And I bought it for my birthday, actually, last year. I decided to treat myself with some online shopping. I got chills. They're multiplying. Holy moly. Suddenly I'm a Pinterest gal like Okay, why did I do that? I did not like doing that. I'm so sorry I'm definitely gonna wear this a lot more than I thought I would like when I saw that on Pinterest I was like, yes, I can recreate that. I can do that I didn't think that it would be my actual favorite outfit from the whole video. I'm gonna say it this one is a 10 out of 10. Like, I wouldn't even think to put this outfit together, let alone wear a belt with these pants and like a boob tube. I love this fit. That was a massive video. Like that took me all day. I am not even kidding. Like how does that take me all day? I don't know. As you can see, the mess on this bed here, it's been hectic, but I'm actually so happy that I did today's video because not only did I find some really cool outfits that I've already had and I didn't even think to put together, but I had a lot of fun doing it. If you guys enjoy these Pinterest videos, I would honestly love to do them like every season i feel like this would be a lot of fun probably not as many outfits as i did today because i'm actually exhausted like why did i do that to myself but i think it'd be a lot of fun to do as like a continuing series so if you guys liked this video give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe down below and press that bell notification because we have a date every sunday anyway i am gonna love you and leave you guys i will see you in my video next sunday so